Is this what being an adult is meant to feel like? Very impressive you're at the gym every night. Maybe if you're working out with a friend or doing something different with your training. Occasionally it might make things feel like less of a grind. Also you could drop one day at the gym and you might have energy on that evening for seeing friends. After work. I think everyone feels like this some of the time but the tide does turn and I hope it does for yourself soon. Never ending exhausted fight against bills and responsibility while trying to experience love and happiness. Cooking 10 meals takes like 10% longer than cooking one meal side takes Sunday evening to meal prep. I find a byproduct to that is I also eat a lot healthier because I'm not just throwing together something quick after I'm tired from a long day of work. Another one is trying to do a quick workout before work too. I find after keeping that up for a while I have a lot more energy at the beginning of the day that makes me feel less burnt out by the end of the day. It's almost like the energy give me a better mindset all day. The last one is just sacrificing sleep. You're exercising and sleeping enough most of the time. Making sure you get out and do stuff to keep you happy is just as important. Follow the 80-20ths rule here. If you sleep right 80% of the time, take 20% of the time to say fuck it. Your mental health and time with friends is just as important as sleep and feeling tired for one. Day in the week is worth not feeling burned out every day of the week. These things have helped me immensely. Hope they help others. Yeah, but it only lasts 40 to 50 years then you get to do all the fun things you want. Yeah, pretty much. I go to work. After work I go work at my house or my GFS house. Then I do some of my hobbies like singing and playing guitar and if I have some time then I watch something on Reddit or YouTube. And this on repeat. I lost most of my friends actually I have now only friends from work since I don't have time to see friends much after work. Pretty much my experience as well. There are some classes and other recurring events I'd like to sign up for. But the thought of having to spend all day at work and then go to school or whatever social thing. Afterwards. And then go home to make dinner and do chores, exercise. I just don't have that kind of energy. Saturday likewise as a wash. I'm so wiped out from the week that I always spend the day napping or doing nothing. Sunday is only marginally better. But then I have to go to work again the next day and start the whole thing over. I fill my time after work with either pursuing my hobbies, which I have a lot of, or hanging out with friends. Doesn't matter how tired I am. I often go to bed very late at night. Perhaps it's because I don't like my job and seek fulfillment but I also have the feeling that I'll never feel fulfilled by work. Whether I like it or not. This has nothing to do with being an adult and everything to do with being in a late stage. Capitalist society. Burnout is an epidemic right now and you are not alone. I work two hours at home a day. Go work out and run about two hours and have tons of extra energy. I really like my work too. I feel it's more of a hobby. Honestly when I talk to my friends or dad who works full time. I feel bad. Cause I understand what it's like to feel constantly exhausted and not want to do other things. IDK. I think work takes too much from us. Everyone should just start growing weed in home. This is why I want to work part-time. I can afford to work part-time. Because I still live with my parents. Full-time made me kinda suicidal. Yeah, you're at a point where if you aren't going out with people immediately after work. You aren't going out. You can embrace it by considering that staying home is actually what you want. People tend to experience FOMO even if they don't want to do the thing they're missing out on. 
I don't do much of anything Monday through Thursday. Once Friday hits though I make the most of it until about dinner time on Sunday when the party ends. And it's time to prepare for the week. This is how it's supposed to feel like to boomers who think working yourself onto depression is a worthy cause. Cause for what? Nothing do do it just because. Short answer. Yes. This is basically what being an adult is all about. Longer answer. Being an adult is, in a very significant sense, all about resource management, managing time, managing money, managing personal energy. There are different strategies. Some people like to have very structured lives with schedules and budgets. Other people hate that and want more spontaneity and or in scheduled time. It's all about what you want. You have one eight hour job, which is a good start. A lot of people historically haven't had that luxury. Either they've been stuck working much longer schedules. Prior to the 1920s, the standard US work week was 10 hours per day, six days per week, or working multiple jobs to make ends meet. So you're starting off from a pretty good place. The rest is figuring out where your time is going and if that's actually how you want to be spending it. You don't mention much in the way of commuting time, which is great if you've already managed to cut that out. Lots of people waste ridiculous amounts of their life commuting outside of work, eight hours and sleeping, hopefully eight hours. There's another eight hours in the day that's going somewhere. You mention spending three hours per day going to the gym and making dinner after work. That certainly seems like a big investment of time and energy. Is that how you want to be spending your time? I've worked out that often when training for something specific, but I don't bother to do it on the regular and find that I can maintain by working out two to three X week. Some people also find that working out in the morning isn't as draining as hitting the gym after work. Not my thing, but why MMV? I find that scheduling social events gives me something to look forward to and plan around. Pre-pandemic, I used to do bar trivia with co-workers once night per week, which was fun. During the pandemic stuff like this has admittedly been hard to pull off. It was nice to have a sort of standing social event one night a week. Easy solution. Have a kid. You'll surely recognize all the time you had. Things you could have done. Bonus. You're broke. So you wouldn't have the money. If you had the time. Try going to the gym in the morning. I've always gone at 5 a.m. and I'm usually up in at it until 9 p.m. so I can get 8 hours. Isn't the point of using military time to not have to specify a.m. or p.m.? This is the trap I seek to avoid. That's pretty much my life as well. Lol that's pretty much being an adult. I never feel like doing anything after working all day. An IDK how other PPL do it. I go to work. Come home. Take care of my two little dogs. Make dinner. Clean up. Work out. Shower. Sleep lol. BC of this I vowed to do minimal overtime. And I take a mini vacation every three months haha. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video. Please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Eracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.